Work ahead. Two Canadian teams qualified to this final out on the ice now in their second appearance at the Grand Prix final. From Quebec, Julianne Seguin and Charlie, Charlie Bilodeau. They finished just off the podium at this event in 2015 and followed it up with a silver medal at the Canadian Championships. on the landing triple twist but you can see they explode out of the element they don't leave the flow take off and he could not get his feet underneath him in time for the landing throw very often just heartbreaking A fight to the finish for Julianne Seguet and Charlie Bilodeau from Canada here in the short program at the Grand Prix Final. Fourth place finish in this event last season, but struggling this time around on several of those elements, unfortunately, in this short program. We'll have to see how much those mistakes cost them when we come back with their scores in just a moment. And up next, the final skater in this pairs event, Yu and Zhang from China, the second top qualifier coming into this event. Can they live up to expectations? We'll find out. Back now with Julian Seguin and Charlie Bilodeau after their effort in the short program. And it was a tough skate, Ryan, but still a fight to the end. Now, earlier this season, they had planned side-by-side -side triple loops. They had put up big scores and done nice short programs, but they weren't feeling confident with the loops. So they scaled back to the side-by-side -side triple styles, an element that they've been doing successfully in competition for years. But there's something in the mentality of scaling back a program when you take things for granted in those moments. I knew as a competitor, if I ever tried to take out a harder element and put in an easier element. I all of a sudden, in the moment, got way more nervous for the easier element. And it appears that that might have been what his mindset was. Well, you have the expectation when you go into what you consider a quote unquote easier element, I'm going to nail this. That's the whole reason why I scaled back. So it's an added pressure, maybe unnecessarily, but it certainly can play with your head. Absolutely. And when those what ifs sneak into your head in a sport where everything is split second, it can really add up. So now we wait to see how much those mistakes cost them with the judges and it is significant. 60.86. You see there the two mandatory deductions for the fall on the triple sow from Charlie and the throw. But just a tough day for Seguin and Bilodeau from Canada.